Hello, everyone. Amy here again. Today, I will teach you how to use Fly Seeing Hat installed on the Gemini motherboard. So let's work before preparation. Okay, now let's install the Fly Seeing Hat on the Fly Gemini V2 board. Yes, over there. Yes. And the right ball of seeing hat is for the right ball of flight Gemini, and the black ball is for the black ball. We need insert in the right color. If inserts the wrong ball, will burn the devils. Yes. Okay. Insert correct. And next. For Gemini needs to adjust the dip switch when using CN hat one two five six two on. So now let's turn on the dip switches one two five and six on the motherboard. Turn on. Yes. We need one Type C USB to connect the motherboard to the computer and one SD card. Is for Linux install, yes. And one SD card is used for installing Clipper the Bean. Okay, yes. One Wi-Fi connector, yes, and insert into the motherboard over there, yes. We need a. Card reader, yes. Now let's use Type C USB to connect the motherboard with the computer. Let's go back to the computer. Here is our website for the tutorial of how to use CN Hat. Here is the very details tell us how to do it. Yes, and now let's go to install the system image into the SD card. Yes, here is our latest system image. Let's download it. It, and now let's insert the SD card into the card reader. Yes, insert here. And connect to the computer. Okay, now let's open this bunny teacher and choose flash the view and choose the latest sister image and select target. Yes, select it and flash. Yes, now. It will take about five minutes, so we need wait patiently. Okay, now the system image is downloaded into the SD card, and now let's pull out the SD card into the motherboard. Yes, over there. Insert here. Yes. Okay, and now let's use Type C USB to connect the motherboard to the computer. Yes, this one, this part. Yes, insert here. Okay, now let's open the Mobster. Yes. The first, we need check our device manager. Yes, here is the CH three four zero port. If here have CH three four zero port, then it is connect、uh, successfully. So we choose this one and port red is one one five two zero zero, right? Now it's Start up screen now. If Fly Gemini appears, it is successfully connect to the. Yes, 
Now let's enter an MTUI to connect a Wi-Fi. Yes, choose up and down key to choose a Wi-Fi and put your password here and enter and wait for it connected. Okay, now here is connected a uh, Wi-Fi, and now let's go back to our interface, and now let's enter IPA to check the IP address. Yes, this is uh, our IP address, and now let's copy it and open the browser and enter it. Yes, this is a Clipper interface. Okay, now let's go back to the mobile store. Yes, enter SSH and put the IP address over here and now write fly and choose OK. Yes, accept. And now write down your password, mellow. Okay, choose the right, yes, cancel. Okay, now it's connected SSH, and now let's enter CD Clipper. Yes, the Clipper interface, and then let's enter Make Clean. Press Enter. Yes, now let's enter Make Menu Config. Enter. Now pop up a window. So now let's choose the STM32. Use up and down to select the menu. The STM32F405. Yes, the Communication interface is CAM bus because Flying Jiminy needs to flash CM boot from MCU or use SD card to flash Clipper firmware that supports CNN, CM bus PA11, PA12. So let's enter and back to the interface. Now let's enter make. Gen 4. Yes, now it's company. Okay, let's wait about two or three, five minutes. Yes, now here is successfully complete. So now let's go to the Clipper folder and find the out folder directly drag Clipper the bin to the desktop or our SD card now insert SD card into the card reader and connect to the computer. Yes, and format it in FAT32 format. Format. Okay, insert into the computer now. Yes, and open it. And now let's drag the Clipper Derby into the SD card. Okay, now let's power off the motherboard and insert SD card and into the motherboard. Yes, now let's first pull out the SD card. Yes. And now, insert into the motherboard. Yes. Use Tab C USB to connect the motherboard to the computer. Again, now let's wait about 10 seconds and then let's see if the Clipper Derby is uh, change to the flag here then it is 
successfully install the clipper the bin into the motherboard. Now let's insert the SD card into the card reader and connect to the computer again. Let's see. The flag queries appear, so it is successfully install the clipper into the motherboard. So now let's insert the SD card again into the motherboard. Yes. Okay, over there. And now let's go back to the computer and copy this command and let's check the UUID of the motherboard. Yes, enter OK. For I have too long time not to use this mobile so now let's go back, enter again to the mobile Yes, connect the SSH again. We just need to push the Apple address over here. Yes. And choose right and then fly. And OK. And uh, write down mellow password. OK. Yes. Cancel. Now is connect SSH and now let's write CD Clipper. Yes, enter CD Clipper. Okay, now let's copy the command again to find the Gemini motherboard UUID. Okay, now let's copy this command. Yes. Let's find this UUID of the motherboard and enter OK. OK, let's wait. OK, now we find this motherboard UUID. Yes, so this is means we can use this CN hat to connect through CNN. Okay, see you next time. Bye.